welcome or welcome back to another video with me life with nine y'all today we're gonna be doing a hygiene shopping video i'm so excited i have to re-up on all of my products especially since you know now it's the fall time i need more face wash i need more face lotion i need body wash i need a whole bunch of stuff y'all so i'm gonna take y'all along with me we're going to target of course a list but now that i'm here i'm fake overwhelmed i know the first thing i do when i get is face wash because that's the first thing i ran out of and face lotion but here's the issue this is the moisturizer i usually get for my face but i wanted to try la roche posay i don't even know how to say it but i want to try this i wanted to try something new so i might get this one but i also need a facial i need a face lotion and i have oily skin and this is for um well, it says for normal to oily skin, so I wanted lotion that is also for oily skin because I made a mistake and got lotion last time that's for normal to dry skin and my skin is definitely very much oily so I need to find one for oily skin. Why is there no facial moisturizer for oily skin? I'm seeing normal to dry. What about the oily girly? This, this is supposed to be fine. Why is it stressing me out already? I think I'm gonna just get the CeraVe that I used last time. I mean, it is for normal to dry skin, but it worked for me last time, so I'm just gonna get it again. I just want to try something new, but there's nothing here for my type of skin type, so I'm just gonna go back to the basics. They have so many cute little travel size products over here, but I did see this lip scrub. I do wanna try out lip scrubs. I love, because I have like this lip scrubber at home, and but I don't actually have like a lip scrub to use, so. I think this would be good. This is the St. Eve's Lip Scrub and Juicy Watermelon. We could try this out. So we're gonna get this too. I definitely need a new body scrub, so I'm trying to figure out which one I want to get. It's between these two. I don't know. Let me give another smell. It smells like a really like peppermint, but like really sweet. But this one smells like a candle, like a really yummy candle. I need help. Fuck. Let me get this one, y'all. This one smells so so good. Don't sleep on Tree Heart products because all their products smell mad good. I have this body butter at home. I have the vanilla one. And I want to try a new one. And they have this pumpkin pop. I want to smell it, see what it smells like. This one smells really good. It smells really, really sweet. And they also have very bright. Mm, I don't really like that one. And there's Cherry Rave. Ooh, this one smells like candy. I like candy. But I'm feeling pumpkin pop. Pumpkin pop smells really good. I like pumpkin pop, but cherry rave. Fuck. I can't decide. I'm going to do pumpkin pop. Cause I just don't get pumpkin scented things. So I just want to try something different. So pumpkin pop, pumpkin pop is the winner. I'm gonna get something that it don't look like somebody used. Cause these fake look used by people. Cause people have no manners or home training. Yeah, I'm gonna get pumpkin pop. I've heard really good things about Good Molecules products and they're right here. So I just want to try the brightening serum because I feel like on my face, I'm getting a lot of dark spots and I want to fade them away because I don't like them. So I'm going to get the niacinamide brightening toner. I heard good things about this. So. Definitely need shampoo, conditioner, and a leave-in conditioner, and a hair oil. So I'm in that section right now. I know this is about to cost me a bag because hair products are a lot. But that's fine. It's okay. I have to get shampoo and conditioner regardless. So I'm trying to figure out what I want. Shea moisture, shampoo, and conditioner. 
And I'm gonna smell them. And this one is coconut waters. Mm, coconut smells good. I love coconut and I love vanilla scented things. This one is pink champagne. I'm not gonna lie, I might get coconut. This one smells good too, but it smells like the body butter that I have. So I think I'm gonna get this coconut waters um, scented lotion. So I'm back home from Target. Um, y'all, I got three bagfuls of stuff from Target. I honestly did entirely too much. Too much. But these are all stuff that I honestly needed. Some stuff was once, but so I'm just gonna start with the first bag. This isn't in any specific order. I'm just picking up the first thing that I see out of the bags. So in this first bag, I got the facial cleanser that I was telling y'all about earlier, the La Roche Posier. Yeah, I don't know how to say this at all, but this is a purifying foaming cleanser and it's for normal to oily skin, like I told y'all earlier. Definitely needed this because I ran out of face wash and I heard a lot of good reviews about it. My bestie uses it, so I wanted to try out a new face wash. I usually use CeraVe, but I wanted to, I've been wanting to try this, so I got this and the next thing i got was some black girl sunscreen i ran out of my black girl sunscreen and i definitely needed to re-up this is so 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 like this sunscreen is so good it makes my skin so glowy it makes it feel so good and obviously sunscreen is good for the skin it keeps you looking young so i had to re-up on my black girl sunscreen this is the spf 30 one so i got that the next thing i got as i seen earlier is a sugar scrub this is to exfoliate my body and it smells so so good this is aura nights um and this y'all oh my gosh i recommend because it smells so yummy it's like sweet it smells like really really sweet this is pistachio seed oil shea butter and willow bark extract from tree hut um, so I cannot wait to use this in the shower. Like, I love me a good exfoliating scrub. It makes my body so soft, so smooth. Chef's kiss for real. And the next thing I got was some exfoliating cotton rounds. I did not mean to get these, y'all. I meant to get the regular ones. I got this. I did the same thing last time. I went to Target and I got these, um, cotton pads and it's the exfoliating ones. And I did not mean to do that, but it's okay. It's alright, so whatever. I got the 100 count, just the regular exfoliating cotton pads or cotton rounds or whatever. So I got these. I hate that. I, I should be picking stuff up, y'all. I'm about to get the regular ones, but it's okay. It's okay. The next thing I got was some toothpaste. Self explanatory. Needed some toothpaste. So I got some toothpaste. I used the Crest toothpaste. Yeah. I also got the Tree Heart Pumpkin Pop Body Butter. This is what I was trying to decide earlier if I wanted the Pumpkin Pop or the Cherry, I forgot what it's called, but the Cherry Scented one. But I went with the Pumpkin Pop. I keep smelling this. It smells so good, y'all. This is what it looks like inside. I wish I can smell it, but it's Pumpkin Seed Oil, Apple Cider Vinegar, and Shea Butter. Wow, Apple Cider Vinegar is, that's interesting. I have never put that on my body before. But that's interesting but yeah this is the body butter i have this in the vanilla scents i'll show that right now i have the same one in the vanilla scent i highly recommend this one as well this one smells so good as y'all can see i'm almost out of this one because i use it a lot because it smells really really yummy so i had to re-up and i wanted to try a different scent so i got that the next thing i got was this um witch hazel facial toner i used to use facial toners a lot in high school but i stopped using them for some reason but i wanted to get back into it so this is the thayer's natural remedy facial toner um aloe vera formula and it's rose petal scent so i got this and for my hair, I got this Rosemary Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil from Miel. I know it's been a lot of controversy over this um, 
hair product Mio, the company. People have been saying that it makes their hair fall out. I have not personally experienced that, so that's why I bought it. Um, and I wanted to try this out because I heard good reviews on this specifically. So yeah, it's um, infused with biotin and encourages long and healthier hair. I also want to take better care of my hair, so I got um, I got me a little hair oil. So. The last thing in this bag is a candle that I got. This is a scented candle. This is a scented candle cedar and alp alpine berry. Hmm. But this is what it looks like. Um, this is the candle. It's a single wick candle. It smells so yummy. Y'all, I love a good scent. Like, I just love things that smell good. So that's why I picked up. That's why I keep smelling things. Like, if y'all noticed throughout this whole video, I just keep smelling stuff. I just love... I just love things that smell good which is why i get things that smell good for my body so i can smell good all the time but that's it for the first bag y'all so we're gonna move on to the second bag and in here i got some pads y'all like i told y'all earlier i'm on my cycle so i needed to re-up on some pads not too much to talk about there and i also got the eos lotion i have the eos lotion in the pomegranate raspberry scent and i got a new one this one is literally almost done it's like down here so I got the new, I got a new one and it is coconut waters. <laughs> Love a good coconut scent. Let me smell it again. Mm, smells so yummy. So I got this one. I love EOS lotion. It's so smooth on the skin. It's so soft and it smells so good. And it's so it's a soothing protection for dry skin. I recommend this, y'all. It smells really, really, really good. The next thing I got was this e.l.f. Power Grip Dewy Setting Spray. I ran out of my setting spray, so I wanted to get a new um, setting spray. And this is the e.l.f. one. So I just got this for my makeup. And Halloween is coming up, so I'm definitely going to need a setting spray when I do my makeup for my costumes. Stay tuned for those vlogs y'all stay tuned for those vlogs and as y'all seen earlier i had to get a shampoo and conditioner and this is from shea moisture i stick by shea moisture's brand like i love shea moisture so much and their products smell really really good and they're so good for my hair and this the both of these is the coconut and hibiscus um curl and shine shampoo and conditioner next thing i got was the good molecules niacinamide brightening toner as i told y'all i have dark spots on my face and i want to treat those um i heard a lot of good reviews about this product i know people don't see results fast but it's just like when you stay consistent with things is when you see results quickly so obviously you just have to stay consistent and that's what i'm going to be doing with this um i feel like people like judge it too quickly some things just take time um but i'll be the judge i'll be the judge for myself everybody's skin type is not the same so um everybody's skin does not react the same to certain products so we'll see so this is what it looks like the niacinamide um brightening toner i really do hope it works for my skin for sure i'm gonna have to read the directions on how to use it but that's what i got i also got a shaver it's pretty self-explanatory i needed a new shaver so i got this and it comes in a pack of two i really hope these don't cut me i hate a razor that's that's that cuts you like easily i hate getting cut by a razor so and to go with the shaver i actually got something new so i got a tree hut moisturizing shave oil guys i usually use shaving cream but i wanted to use a shaving oil and this is from tree hut it's a watermelon scent and it says soothe skin and helps pr protect against cuts as i was saying earlier i hope i don't get cut and even if i do i'm gonna use the shaving oil that smells really good and like watermelon and it's gonna protect me from those cuts so <laughs> i got this um and i'm pretty sure it's an oil so it's gonna make my skin feel like really smooth and soft that's really the goal for me i just want silky smooth soft skin all, at all times so i got the saint eve's um soothing body wash oat melon shea butter i do enjoy shea butter I, I feel like shea butter um is really good for the skin so i got this some regular body wash for me and my mom for our bathroom and then like i told you earlier i settled and i got the CeraVe daily moisturizing lotion it's not really me settling but as y'all heard me say earlier i have oily skin and i want products that are more um targeted for oily skin but this is for normal to dry skin and like i said i used it before and it was still it still worked for me it was still good still moisturizing my skin didn't feel any kind of way so i just got it again but i definitely wanted something from like more oily prone skin but it's fine 
I just needed some face lotion anyway, regardless. So it's okay. The next thing I got, um, I heard really good things about this, y'all. I use a spray bottle for my hair a lot. So I wanted to try this, and I love the As I Am brand too. So I wanted to try this Jamaican Black Cast Oil Water with Ceramide, Vitamin C, and E. Um, I just wanted to try this water out for my hair because I spray my hair a lot. Like, I'm always in the bathroom. So since this has Jamaican Black Cast Oil in it, and it has all those vitamins and stuff in it. I wanted to try it out, so I got this for my hair. Next thing I got was this TheraBreath um, mouthwash. Me and my mom use TheraBreath. It's really good for your mouth. It doesn't burn um, like Listerine does. I don't, I mean, I've been using Listerine like my whole life for real, but then I got put onto this and I have not really went back to Listerine. Unless I'm like traveling and get like the little travel size Listerine bottle, but this is what I've been using as my mouthwash. It does not leave your breath stinky. Your breath will smell good all day. And when you brush your teeth at night and use this as your mouthwash, your mouth is go you're gonna wake up and your mouth is not even gonna be sneaky for real. Like, so y'all, I recommend TheraBreath mouthwash for sure, for sure, for sure. And this is the yellow bottle, obviously as y'all can see, and it says kills 99.9% .9 of germs that cause bad breath, plaque, and gingivitis. It's antiseptic, um, deep clean oral rinse. This is not sponsored, but I still recommend um, TheraBreath. Give me that sponsorship. Thank you. Period. Last thing in this bag, I got these, I got two Elf Glow lip oils. Y'all, I'm so excited to use these. I've heard good reviews about these two. Um, I got a clear one and I got one in a, what is this, Rose Envy. So this is going to act as like a lip gloss, but it's really just going to be a lip oil. It's supposed to last all day or last a very long time on your lips. We're on to our last bag. Next thing I got, I got so many masks i did not realize i got so many i just be picking stuff up like i have no type of self-control what's wrong with me but i want to do like a nighttime routine y'all on my channel so i wanted to do like a face mask and wash my face and do you know everything that i do during the nighttime to prepare myself to get ready for bed and stuff like that so i got a moisturizing hydro gel eye mask and it's supposed to help reduce the appearance of fine line and wrinkles and leave your skin feeling plump and looking brighter and it just hydrates the skin around your eyes so i just wanted to try this out and use it and then i also got two masks so i got a pink clay mud mask and a cooling avocado clay mask both from cubella i've used cubella products before and i love how they feel and they're very cheap they're, these were like two dollars or a dollar 99 for real um so i just got a pink one because i love pink and <laughs> it has oil absorbing natural clays detoxifying these sea salt and aloe vera extract aloe vera is really good for your skin so that's really why i got this and this one has avocado oil shea butter and cocoa butter i love cocoa butter for the skin as well so i just got these two for whenever i decide to do a mask and the next one i got was a brightening peach mask as i told y'all i want to start brightening the scars that i have on my face so it's just just a sheet mask really so i got this I cannot wait to do some self-care like i just i generally cannot wait like an at-home spa day the next thing i got were these tongue scrapers or tongue cleaners i've heard a lot of people say a lot of good things about these um it's very important to scrap to scrape your tongue brush your tongue we don't want no sticky breath over here so i got a pack of tongue scrapers um even after you brush your teeth or even before you brush your teeth just scrape that tongue get all that plaque off that's what makes your breath really stinky so we don't want that so it comes with a lot honestly um so yeah i got these pretty sure my mom would use some too so i just got some for the both of us i got a new elf power grip primer this is the travel size one because i have the bigger one but I, it's still some in there so i didn't really need a bigger one for real so that's why i got the smaller one and like i said halloween's coming up so i'm gonna need stuff that like primes and sets my face for when i do my makeup and i y'all <laughs> this is my holy grail micellar water this is so so good for removing your makeup like you don't really need the makeup wipe like this does it all seriously you take a cotton pad or whatever you want to use pour some of this on there use it on your face your makeup comes off so easy and it's really like a water for real like i i love this thing i stand by it and i needed to re-up on it so so bad so i got some micellar cleansing water and it's really good for your skin so got this next thing i got was a coconut and hibiscus curl and shine hair mask like I've been saying, I want to take better care of my hair. So I got this hair mask. Um, this is going to act as like my deep conditioner. I'm going to leave it in my hair for probably like 15, 20 minutes with like a shower cap on to keep the heat in so it can like really get inside of my hair. Um, and yeah, I cannot wait for my next hair wash day. 
that's probably gonna be a part of my night routine maybe and i'll like style my hair and do like my whole face mask stuff like that so let me know in the comments if y'all want me want me to do a nighttime routine i mean i'm gonna do it regardless but like just let me know if y'all want to see it for real <laughs> but yeah so i got this from shea moisture as well because i told y'all i live by shea moisture and next thing i got i really wanted to try miss jessie's like i've been seeing this hair product every time i go to the store i see miss jessie's and i always wanted to try their products their packaging and like how it looks it's just so cute and so pretty so i just wanted to try it this is the jelly soft curls um i think this is a gel so i wanted to try it out it says it's a wash and go for people who want popping curls without the crunch i do um super soft super soft curls i do major definition i do and the shiniest smoothest and softest curls ever I definitely do but I just want to see what this does for my curls and how it reacts to it I definitely just wanted to try it out mmm whoa and this smells really really good wow I didn't even smell this one I can't wait to use this y'all I'm gonna give y'all a little review when I use it because I've never tried Miss Jessie's products but I always wanted to so I got I got some today so I got some Dove sensitive unscented soap y'all this is really good for cleaning down there you don't want to use anything scented down there it's really bad for your pH balance it'll throw it off and I've heard that dove soap unscented dove soap is really good to clean down there if you don't want to use just water because using just water is okay to clean it as well but if you want to use like if you want to feel better and you like use some soap unscented soap is really good and dove unscented soap especially is really good so the sensitive one and it, it says beauty bar fragrance free hypoallergenic so this will be really good i also got the lip scrub as i showed y'all earlier it's the saint eve's lip scrub and juicy watermelon um this is what it looks like y'all let me show y'all the lip like exfoliating thing that i have i got it from marshall's a while back and i never used it because i didn't have a lip scrub but i gave one away but i have the pink one and it's really cute and has like soft bristles on it and you just put your fingers through hair and just scrub your lips get away all the dead skin just to make your lips more soft and smooth so i finally got me a little lip scrub the last thing i got from target y'all was this febreze air mist hawaii and hawaiian aloha this smells really good i sprayed it in the store <laughs> and i just needed a air freshener like i just we haven't had an air freshener in my house in mad long and i love when my room smells really good especially after cleaning it um so i got this for my room um, so that's all i got from target but yeah guys i really hope you guys enjoyed my target haul i bought too much i spent too much shout out to my friend shayla because she gave me a 40 dollars target gift card for my birthday so i got 40 dollars off of my purchase like who who doesn't want 40 dollars off of their target purchase like girl if you're watching this i love you for that because I hope you guys enjoyed watching this i hope you guys stay to the end um do not forget to subscribe to my channel i know you guys love me because i love y'all like just press the subscribe button while you're here i'll wait you do it yet oh okay thank you guys so much for watching i'll see y'all in my next video y'all i'm redoing my room or i'm rearranging the layout of my room so that's most likely going to be my next video so stay tuned for that bye y'all i love y'all